back to another Genshin Impact reaction video. So, my last video, I asked all of you to give me more recommendations. We are not done with the Genshin Impact rabbit hole, and I was like, what should we check out next? And the comment section pretty much simultaneously all said, the boss themes are the next place to go. So, the number one recommended boss theme for me to start with is this seven minute long boss theme right here, La Signora? La Signora? Let me know if I'm pronouncing it correctly in the comment section down below. And also, let me know what we're reacting to next. What is the next Genshin Impact, either boss theme or video or combination of videos? Let me know in that comment section what you guys would like to see you control this journey. So let me know down below. Enough talking from me. Make sure you press that subscribe button. We are so close to 300k. Press that subscribe button and help me get there. And let's jump into my first time ever reaction to the one and only Genshin Impact boss theme, La Signora. weird element of like horror around this it, it feels kind of terrifying in a weird way like it, 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 it's, got, it's got like a horror movie feel to it This is kind of spooky. Um, this is a different vibe to Genshin. I don't think I've felt before. They, like, Genshin, I, I understand it's got, like, some emotional parts to it. it um, like, at least from what I've seen, it seems like it can, it can definitely be quite emotional, quite gut-wrenching, right? But um, I haven't seen any, like, horror aspects to it. But this one definitely gives me that kind of vibe to it with the cult choir coming in with the sort of tap tone that we've got in the background as well. I kind of feel kind of scared. I don't, I don't know if I'm way off, but it, it feels kind of spooky. Weird. Quiet now. Absolutely incredible just how much diversity is in the Genshin Impact music. Like, it's insane. None of the OSTs, none of the character themes, nothing sounds the same. It's all completely different. Every, like, the, um, the diversity in the music is incredible. And this just shows it. This, is, this, this, this boss theme isn't like anything else I've heard. And I've reacted to so much Genshin stuff music now at this point. And this is like none of them. This is so different. So different. Yeah. I, I don't even know what to say. It, it, this feels like a flipping, um, like, you, like they walked into a haunted house, the door closed behind them, and out of the ground pops this fucking evil golem creature. What's the name of the boss? Is the boss called La Sig uh, Signora? Is that the name of the boss? What does the boss look like? Is this the boss? My 
next question is: Are the boss fights like, like, uh, what's the word? Like a like a World of Warcraft boss fight? Is that is that the right comparison or a Destiny boss fight where the boss fights can last like hours, where you had to like prepare for them, or are the boss fights more uh, a, a, like accustomed to sort of like the style of like uh, Metal Gear Solid or uh, Devil May Cry, like those sort of boss fights? <laughs> Transformation phase. What the fuck is going on now? Also, the sun appears to be blinding you guys. Let me just help you right there. There you go. That's better. What the hell is the uh, the transformation phase? Is this like, I'm guessing the boss has leveled up? You know, like in a game where you think you've won and all of a sudden the health bar comes back? Is that what's going on? Is this the same boss? Crimson Witch of Ember. so terrifying it's not just me right this is fucking terrifying the music is so terrifying why does it have this vibe to it why, why am i sitting here scared what the hell i never expected this from genshin what the hell it's kind of spooky This is so epic. This is so epic. This is so epic. This is this is this is crazy. This is absolutely crazy. When you have these boss fights, do you fight with your entire party? What happens if a party member dies? Does the boss fight continue? Or does it stop then? Is it like one party dies, everyone dies? Um, or is it like last person standing kind of a deal? Um, holy shit, this is epic. This is epic. The second phase is just like ramped up, man. Oh, Jesus Christ. You got the guitar coming in now. The orchestra's getting much more dark and grungy with it. Oh my God. some John Williams stuff man it's just like a room full of a whole live orchestra on stage this is the kind of stuff you would expect when you see the new Christopher Nolan movie this is a game this is crazy this is so it's so amazing it's so awesome it's so cool Tell me there's gonna be an anime as well. Is the anime gonna be similar to the animation of League of Legends that was arcane, where it's gonna tell like one story? Or is the anime going to be more broad and tell the entire story of Genshin? Does anyone know yet? Is there a confirmation or anything about what the anime is gonna be about? <laughs> Incredible. 
this is a 10 out of 10. This is this is absolutely beautiful. Oh my god, man. This is this is amazing. You could show this to anyone. No one would ever think this is from a game. This is this is mind blowing. This is so stunning. Also, the the I'm, I'm, the more I look at her, the more I'm feeling like she looks like some sort of like bug or insect, like a prey mantis or something like that. God now, with the flipping like marching music coming in with the thundering heavy metal now just to wrap it all up. This is awesome. This is a boss theme. So as what is that? That looks kind of spooky. What the hell's that one? As as ha da? As a da ha? Uh, battle theme, all phases. Holy mother of cheese, man! That was that was um that was something, you know. That was um that was from a game. That was from a game. How did Genshin never stop surprising me? You know, it, it, I I I I have nothing to say. I've reacted to so many video game OSTs at this point, and some of them are absolutely incredible, right? But None of them are like Genshin. And what I mean by that before you think I'm crapping on other video games, I'm not. But what I mean by that is when it comes to Genshin, the whole game has like a soundtrack. The entire game, every single character, every boss theme, every flipping new trailer, everything has like this entire, every town, everything has this entire like full blown orchestral 10 out of 10 musical performance soundtrack around everything there's no half ass no rushing nothing it is a love project and you see that when you literally listen or react to anything to do with genshin anything it is incredible with a lot of games that i love the osts of it's like three or four songs in that game and i find them completely epic devil may cry is a good example of that devil may cry has some awesome osts but the entire soundtrack is not what i'm there for it's those songs within the game right Whereas in Genshin, the entire soundtrack and everything in it is, is just... And everything's so different and diverse and intricate. Like, it's not like there's one underlying theme for everyone. It just slightly changes for every character, you know? Like, this, like, uh, like, like the movie Scream. This is the best example I can think of. You've got the underlying soundtrack for Scream. But then when Dewey's on screen, it goes like... Bom, 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 and he has, like, his bass sound. And what I mean is, you could easily have it where you have an underlying soundtrack... And then every character gets like a slight twinge, like a slight, like it changes a little bit and it signifies that character, right? But that's not what Genshin did. They created these whole epics that every, everything, everything to do with their game. Everything. I, I can't believe this. This was mind-blowingly awesome. It was, this was amazing. This was so epic, so incredible, so much love went into this. I, I can't even imagine how amazing it must be to actually play this boss fight and have this soundtrack going on while this terrifying boss fight is happening. Um, people have said I should react to this one and then the Sh uh, Shogun one, um, the Raiden one. Uh, let me know which one you guys want me to react to next. If the, oh man, if, if the boss themes are all this good, how many are there? I'm going to love every single one of them if they're this good. This was awesome. This was so good. So good. Oh man, the music's what got me into the Genshin world anyway. And then checking out the trailers, it made me want to play it. I'm really excited to check out more. This was awesome. Let me in that comment section down below. What one we're reacting to next? I can't wait to read the comments and see where you guys are sending me. I am going to play Genshin on Twitch. I did make that promise. I am going to do it. Uh, hopefully, I'll be doing it next month. I am planning on doing it soon. Uh, not sure when. It'll just be when I get some time. Um, but yeah, that is the plan. I do want to play this game. Hopefully, you guys are all enjoying my reactions. If you are, make sure you press that like button. Make sure you guys subscribe if you're not subscribed already. And let's go over that 300k milestone. We've been we've been ticking towards it for ages. We've sort of had a recent jump and we're very, very close. So press subscribe and let's finally get over that milestone.
Anyway, I love all of you wonderful people. Have an incredible day. Thank you very much for watching. And as always, my friends, you right there will see me in the next video.